Hello and welcome to our channel. In this tutorial you will learn how to optimize an animated GIF. GIFs can be quite hefty and at times too clunky to be sent over the internet. The solution to all this is to optimize your GIF files. Here are a few options to consider. 1. When creating your GIF, make sure you're not using complex amount of colors. Two or three color GIFs will be much smaller than a GIF with a few hundred colors. 2. Keep your GIF resolution small. It's a good idea to stay under 720p, as even the 720p resolution can be rather daunting on the GIF size. 3. As you can tell, most of everything is going to have an impact on your GIF sizes. This includes the amount of detail in the GIF. Simple monotone shapes will yield smaller files. 4. Keep your GIFs short and concise. 5. Make each layer of your GIF to be kept for 2 or 4 frames. This results in the same length of animation with 2 or 4 times less frames. 6. If you are creating animations through PowerPoint, make sure you export out medium or small files. And finally, if all else fails, visit easygif.com and click Optimize. Click Choose File and select the GIF file you want and click Upload. Next, we have a drop-down menu and a slider. Let's adjust the slider around and click Optimize GIF. You can then compare the quality and the size of the image before and after optimization. You can also choose an option for a drop-down menu for additional settings. Feel free to experiment to find the best combination that won't degrade the quality drastically. These are some general tips as to how to keep your GIF sizes manageable. How often do you have to use GIFs on your computer? If you liked this video, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel. And make sure to press the bell button to be the first to know about our new videos.